So I see the airport snow. There's a outpost right up there. A lot of farmland. I'm pressing space and F. Space and F. And I'm aiming for kind of the farm area, but kind of the airstrip too, because I kind of want an airplane. Now it seems to me that's a player's base. What would be my first move on the island? So I'm looking for rocks. So I found some rocks. I search under them. I'm making a stone axe head. Starter card is getting destroyed. After I get that small axe head, I'm going to make a knife. So two rocks, stone knife. Putting it in the hand. I'm getting rid of my orange. I'm cutting these up. All right, so once we cut our orange off of us, we're just completely white. We're going to go over here, and we're going to cut. We're going to cut down this tree with the stone knife rock we're looking for big sticks creating them into small sticks okay so i'm gonna go cut another tree try to get five small sticks so i got five small sticks right here i'm gonna make a tree bark rope I'm gonna go back over to the rags wherever they are right here I'm going to make a quiver. Uh, equipped. Take this rope and take this axe head. And now I'm going to try to make an axe. So what do we need to make a stone axe? We need one long wooden stick or a small stick. An improvised rope. So we're going to go over where we just cut. We're going to pick up our stone knife. Take in hand. And we're going to cut one more. One more tree. It's probably going to give me only one long stick and two small sticks. Or oh, give me two long sticks. And this is where I'm going to make another tree bark rope. And take one of the small sticks and make an axe. Then I'm going to craft this axe. To get rid of the stone knife to make more sticks from bushes and chop down more trees. So I'm going to take that in hand. I'm going to take this. And now I'm going to see what do I need for a bow. So I need one long stick. I'll cut this down. Guarantee I get a long stick. We're going to craft a 35 draw bow. Now the bow would be great. You know, it would be great. If we had something to use the bow with. AKA arrows. And with the new update, you can just press auto craft. And it'll craft all the small sticks into arrows right by you. So after this gets done, I'm going to put them into the quiver. But once I add 12, I go in third person. I put the arrow in my hands. Or I just, you know, put it back on my back. And I'm ready to explore. It did seem like a base was over here. I'm not too worried about it. This would be how you get XP for farming. Now, this is not my base, but it's easy XP. I didn't put anything in farming, and I'm already almost a quarter. I would not worry about farming, because you can create one of these and plant seeds and just have an XP farm, <laughs> literally. One thing to note when a flag is outside a base like this, I don't know why they did this, but you can overtake their flag. And then... As I'm just running around, my awareness goes to basic. So we'll go towards a city and we will we'll go to the city and look for some clothes, see what items I can find, hopefully a backpack, hopefully maybe a stab root vest, maybe a car. One thing to note, every time you loot, close your door. Just remember where you came from.
So now I found a kill. It gives me more inventory. One more spot. But it's better than nothing. Now I found a jacket. That should give me quite a bit as well. Beans have more storage than the kilt, so I'm gonna drop the kilt for the jeans. I hear zombie. We'll get our first kill. And that is our first kill with this character. Now zombies, they may have screwdrivers on them. Hey, just like that. They may have screwdrivers on them if you find a bobby pin. You can make a lock pick, or if you just find a lock pick, you can pick the locks at the police stations and different POIs to get weapons, scars, bandages, armor, a lot of different things. Sometimes when you shoot zombies with a bow and arrow, they do eat your arrows, so you have to search them to get them back. So those would be my very first steps going into scum in 2024, creating a quiver, creating a bow, getting arrows, going to the city and trying to get different clothes for more storage. And then after that, just going to city to city to city to city, seeing if I can find more parts to scavenge, sell, find more guns, ammo, just just it all it's a very short very basic tips but coming from a newcomer i did not know how to do a lot of these things so i just thought i'd make a video showing if you stuck around this far like if you're new subscribe we do live sunday monday tuesday we got a lot of shorts tiktoks it's in the bio like it appreciate it much love